I just come back buying a measuring tape, which is really funny because I wanted to go buy some fabric for the t-shirt I want to make right now. And I realized I don't know how much I need, how much fabric I need, and I can't even measure how much I need. So this was really unfortunate. So but I have one now, which is the important thing and we can finally start buying some fabric and stuff like that. So let's go. <music> to buy a sewing machine right now I will go for that into the city there is a sewing machine store and I want to check it out so I'm not sure if I buy it directly I will ask what kind of machine will be best suited for a beginner I already know kind of know what kind of machine I want to have or I already checked out the internet etc etc but I still want to ask anyway yeah let's just go and we'll see how it goes and I will not film in the store itself because Switzerland is really cautious about photos and videos so I'm probably not gonna film there because it will probably be the only one in the store so yeah um, but let's just go it doesn't really matter what the hell <laughs> it doesn't really matter and yeah I'll show you the machine what I've got if I get one so let's go there she is there she is I finally got my own sewing machine and yeah it's damn pink but whatever, it only needs to do what it needs to do, it doesn't matter how it looks like. I'm currently missing a table right now, I will put it here, right here, and I will go tomorrow to Ikea and get a simple table, because I can't use this one with a computer, right? Every time putting everything down and everything back up, it's way too much work, like I did last time, I don't want to do that anymore. So yeah, and I carried this whole machine, the whole the way, from the store in the city till here, like I walked 30 minutes with it thing and with it heat outside, I'm so dead. Uh, and I still need to work now, so yeah, we'll see us all tomorrow. And maybe tonight at the time I unpackage this package. <laughs> this machine, we'll see, maybe I do it tomorrow, maybe I do it tonight. See so, ya. Yeah. A new day arrived and we're going to buy some fabric today or now right now because the store has like only one hour longer open so anyway we're going right now and after that after I hopefully succeeded to buy some fabric I just want to have some simple black fabric and I'm just going to buy that I guess I hope it will be working out will be working out and we'll see how it goes and after that we're going to IKEA as I mentioned before and we'll look for a table like for a simple table and yeah let's Come with me and we'll see how it goes. And yay, I got the fabric. The people at the store were super kind to me. Like, I was going in without the plan, like any plan, I don't have a clue about anything. And yeah, she explained to me like stuff, how I need to sew. And yeah, I learned actually a lot in this 10 minutes I was in the store. So thanks a lot if you maybe ever see this video, probably not. Thanks for giving me the black fabric and yeah. And now we're going to go to IKEA. The third time and saying this the third time, what the fuck. And yeah, we'll see how it goes. Because I don't have a car and a table in the bus. I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> this whole thing by myself from IKEA to the bus station and from the bus station to my home. It wasn't the problem even wasn't that hard to carry. It wasn't that heavy but yeah it totally fucked me. Or oh, my arms at least. It hurt. It definitely did hurt. Uh, but I somehow managed and I'm completely drenched but it's fine. I did my workout for today and I managed it. I have a new table now. I just need to put it together and tomorrow I will set up the whole place with a new table and the machine after work probably and we'll see how it looks. We'll see, we'll see. I'm really curious and I really look forward to it. I hope I can put this table together alone. I'm, I hate that kind of stuff. I'm so bad at it. Well, we'll see, we'll see. I'm totally crazy somehow with me. Yesterday I carried 
the sewing machine from the sewing machine store till to my home. It was like a 30 minutes walk with this thing. And today I have this table. I'm totally crazy and I'm so dead. We're going to build up the table now. I will put it here in this corner at the window here. And yes, it's like super raining outside right now and super refreshing, but I will probably get drenched at the time I need to go to work later on. So yeah, anyway, um, we're going to build up the table now. Let's go. I did it and I already found a challenge. I can't open the window if I put the table right here, but I still have a second one. I didn't really want a bad one, but it was included, so I just put it on. I think I can put on my coffee or my laptop or whatever on here. And yeah, and I can like suddenly sew on the table with a nice light. And I think I can also make some nice pictures on here. So yeah, I think it was worth. I'm totally proud of me doing everything alone, even though it's just a simple table. I'm normally not talented in that kind of stuff. As you can see, I also unpackaged my sewing machine and put it on my new table, yay! And yeah, I also bought some clothes, as you could see. And I'm ready now to sew a t-shirt. Hopefully I don't fail. And this will be a learning progress. I try to learn everything and we'll see how it goes. And let's have some fun. I know this video might be a little bit of a mess, but I hope you like this little journey. I did with you guys and yeah in the next few days I also start doing this t-shirt and logically I will film it and we'll see how or when I will upload it. Thanks so much for watching I really appreciate you guys watching this mess and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel so you don't miss my journey or my next videos in the future. Also give this video a like and don't forget to click on the bell next to it to not miss my future videos I will Really appreciate it. One more time, thanks for watching and we'll see us all next week.